Oh, and apparently sound alerts got an update. That's fun. I'm, I'm honestly gonna have to get rid of that. I'm too lazy to update that. Anyways, we're back. Um, I don't, know, I don't know why I was the sprite. That's weird. Anyways, there's a small possibility that Jose will join, but I'm just calling here. I'm just calling in the group DM just in case he wants to join. But he doesn't seem like he wants to. But you never know. He said he said he might. Uh, just gonna check my equipment again real quick. Tiger mask, tiger suit, and the frosty ring. Yeah, it looks pretty good to me. Yeah, the only thing we haven't really updated yet is like uh, Gnarly and his body armor. Yeah. Speaking of Gnarly, he did an interview with Lotus Juice. Oh. So that's pretty cool. I was like, hey, no way, my man did a fucking interview with the funny rapper man himself. Uh, did you watch it? Yeah, it was, it was like a half an hour long. I mean, honestly, most of it isn't even him interviewing uh, Lotus Juice. Like, I think he does like one question, but he uploaded it anyways because they allowed him to record it. And then they just asked Lotus Juice a bunch of questions like, you know, like... Oh, what was it like before, um, before you, you know, did music for Atlas? Uh, I think I have to head back to the Rebel base first before we can go forward. Wait, where should we go? Uh, the coffee shop, the, the Rebel base, that place. Oh, okay. Hey, at least you got a level up. Yeah. Oh. Well, you're, you're, pretty, you're pretty much gonna be the words of wisdom from here on out. What's wrong? I see. I like his... Well, don't give up, give up yet. You know Thanatos is up to something, but now the Emperor wants a truce. It's <laughs> sure he does. The Emperor? He said he wants peace. That's Cap. <laughs> Maybe we could give the Emperor a chance. I'm gonna write. Last time Palpatine did that, it was a bad idea. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure he just... <laughs> He's out of nowhere. <laughs> Somehow Palpatine returned. <laughs> yeah, after getting thrown into the Death Star, that then blew up. Yep. We've made the Emperor <laughs> change his mind. This is what we've been waiting for. I've been waiting for this. Okay, we'll go. Come with us. After this meeting, your journey will be over. Cap, right? Go on ahead. That's also Cap. That it'll be over. Yeah, he's still got a while to go. There's still loads of game left, but I won't complain. Won't complain about the lag, though. Yeah, I have this... I, I don't know if you experienced this, but I have this thing where I don't want to play a game, and then I end up playing... Oh. I have this thing where, like, I don't want to play a game, and then I end up playing the game, and then I end up having fun, and I'm like, why didn't I want to play it? <laughs> I don't know if you experienced that at all. A few times, I suppose. Just kind of being in a bad mood. No, well, it's not that I'm in a bad mood. Like, today, I didn't really want to play Secret of Mana, but now that I'm playing it, it's fun. Where is everybody? Like, sometimes I just... Sometimes I just force myself to play, and I end up having fun regardless. What a day to remember. We crushed the rest of and the man tonight. Man of night. I'm down. Trapped. <laughs> Man, that, that guy on the base is going crazy. Uh, I agree if I can hear the music right now. Oh, I should have known better. Let us out of here. Oh, Emperor Van Handel. Oh, yeah, he has a name. He is a dog. It's not, uh, a, it's not a dog. I, I did. I did. It's just an insult. But I didn't realize I could add a name. <laughs> it's like in the bottle of the year of the remake, he's just called the Emperor. Oh, that could have. That could be a localization thing. She want out, yeah. huh? Yeah, maybe not. I mean, it, like Final Fantasy II's main villain is also just called the Emperor outside of like a novel or something. Let everyone out. <laughs> Relax. Wait your turn. And surprise boss fight. 
Hey, this guy looks familiar. It's the fucking antline guy from the first part of the game. Yeah, the mantis oh. hands. Oh, the mantis. Yeah. But he's a white mantis now. Sure. <laughs> and Zeppi yeah. sent a funny uh, troll face. Yeah. Metal he's mantis. A robot he's a robot now. Oh. That gives me a good idea. Oh yeah, he's weak to self and stuff. Go fire bouquet. Okay, we're on you know, fire. We're on fire. Fire! Yeah. I'm gonna cast Fire Soul on you. <laughs> I've been watching way too much Sailor Moon recently. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> well, uh, so it, that was quite the mini boss. Actually, we don't, that's not even a mini boss, dude. That was a micro boss. They for the power of magic being stupid. Yay. <laughs> Way just to go. Brain dead magic. Just brain dead magic. Oh, they just need an, exclu an excuse to give us the glove orb. I don't know where to go. Yeah, I Okay, definitely not up here. <laughs> Did we get to listen to fucking Seinfeld again. Let's go. Okay. I love Seinfeld, dude. Yes. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. There's a chest there. A thousand bucks. Gold. Well, that'll that'll cover the uh, the funds of our next fairy walnut that we'll need. Oh God! Oh, uh, meet the Emberman. Emberman? Uh, uh, like the slime, you guys can duplicate themselves. So it's just um, I'll fight them once, and then I'm gonna skip them from here on out because I do not feel like dealing with duplicating enemies. Duplicating enemies are not my friend. There we go. They don't really look like embers. They look more like, you know, slimy man. They're malefic maleficent blobs. Thanks, the soldiers went for help. Let's get out of here. Can't, can't do that. The basis is having the tie of his life over there. Oh my lord. <laughs> Nope, not dealing with that. Levels are not an issue, considering how fast bosses die in this game. Except for Dracula and the tiger. Yeah, if we didn't run out of magic, Dracula would have been piece of cake. And there we just suffered for like Come on, man. Where's your, fa where's your favorite grinding spot at, anyway? Uh, a mountain area we'll be able to go to soon. Okay, maybe in a few episodes. Uh, honestly, it'll probably be at the end of this one. Depending on how long it takes for us to get through right, here. Screw that guy. Actually, I got a better idea. Um... Uh, the mountain area is our next destination. Mountain area, huh? Spam fire! Yeah, see that's 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 as strong. That's actually stronger than my attack on one enemy. Like fire bouquet goes stupid. Yeah, you might as well forget that I was there where you can scramble it right now. Oh shit! Wait, did we deep restock on fairy walnuts? I'm pretty sure we did. Heck okay, yeah, we did. <laughs> Just making sure. Wouldn't go anywhere without fairy walnuts. Because, yeah, we're gonna have a boss at the end of this place before we're allowed to leave. Most thing that's a trend recently with these dungeons. A trend that they just have a mid boss, and then they have an actual boss at the end. Ooh, okay, that was a good hit. <laughs> we need we need more uh we need more dungeon themes. They're literally just a base solo. <laughs> I 
It reminds me of the Yoshi's uh, Woolly World Castle song. That also has a pretty good bass solo in it. Oh, uh, how many, let me see it. I think we have seven, right? Yeah, let's, seven let's, very well. maybe, let's please not use those right now. Oh. They might be ready to get to their healer. Too late. Try not to use fire bouquets very much from now on. Okay. I'd rather not be a back to a situation anymore. You're right, you're right. Granted, the next boss won't like, fly out of our region at the time, but still. Defender level 6? Oh, hell no, Spongebob. Alright, here, I'm gonna charge up my whip then. My whip. Die armor, man. Die armor. You don't belong in this world. Die armor, man. It's not to my attack. There you go. Can't dodge that. And there's treasure in here. Got an hey. axe orb. And he turned into a man! I got a whip orb, let's go! Oops. I mean, honestly, it's probably better just to leave. We have enough, we have enough fucking armor snipes to deal with anyway. No, 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 gnarly. no gnarly. That's not the way to go. You should know better. Uh, Have you ever actually middle. played all these basics or something? Wait, oh yeah, you... we got news. Did you say say? Did you say all these basics? Yeah. <laughs> Are you asking I if I've played it? Yeah. Uh, also, nope. Okay. But I saw a fuck ton of playthroughs. And I think the only one I actually saw beat the game was Markiplier. So and that means as well. And after that, I, I stopped watching it. But I do have him as a skin for Marth in Smash Bros. Armored Man. Oh, that it really is just his name. Yeah. Well, I didn't believe it at first. And we also got the Dark Ninjas. That's their name as well? Yeah. Hmm. Dark Ninja. Wouldn't be surprised if those are the Nintendo Ninjas. Considering how red they are. And we also got Evil Books. What the fuck? Right. I don't <laughs> think that's a- Evil Book? I don't think that's actually a name, but that's just what I'm calling it right now. You know what? With a name as stupid as Armor Man, I'll, I'll believe Evil Book is a, is a real name. <laughs> Jose. Hey, Jose. Hey, what's up? I was trying to avoid you. Uh, I see that's gonna be a running gag. <laughs> oh yeah? Why? <laughs> Why is it ever gonna be a running gag? <laughs> you said that the last few times. Yeah. Anyways, oh. I'm, fi I'm fighting- we're fighting the Nintendo Ninjas right now. The Nintendo Ninjas. What's yeah, that? That's new. Can you kill me? Because I'm getting combo by the <laughs> Oh. Combo Breaker. Those are what the Nintendo Ninjas look like? Yeah, this game's stuff lock is quite the ninjas. Yeah, they're, they're red and they're rude. And they use blast explosion magic. They look like a mixture between Mega Man and Ninja Gaiden. Are you even on my parsec yet? No. Oh. <laughs> then how do you know what they look like? How are you? Because I'm watching your stream. Oh. Well, how's Engage going? How's Engage? Yeah. Well, it's actually really fun. Hey. Well, that's good to hear. Engage is actually a lot more fun than I think. Like I said, it. I think it's way better than Three Houses. Oh, wait, the uh, place on the wall. Oh. That's right, I'm, that's right, I'm gonna get a lot of controversial opinion from this. I enjoyed Engage when Bevy played it. Mostly the mods. Yeah, but honestly, Engage without mods, it's just not as fun. <laughs> Ow. Yeah, you would be suffering through the dog shit story. And... Yeah. But the gameplay, however, is actually fun. I mean, when you look at the gameplay, it's actually quite fun. Yeah, it's, yeah, fast, fast it's, it's literally fast-paced. 
I like fast yeah, paced. Engages gameplay is really fast paced. I mean, heck, you did tell me that that engage was a lot faster than Path of Radiance. Mm. Well, you, you were voicing the Emperor. Yeah, I'm just waiting for him to stop talking for a second. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yes, you're at the real thing. Sir, one more chance, please. Why not? Finish them up uh, there, come to the palaces. They yeah, are finally Mech Rider again. <laughs> oh. I replayed my honor. Alright, but first, we need to step outside. <laughs> we should probably... Beater. Might want to heal up. Actually, never mind, you're out of magic. Who needs magic? Right, there we go. And, uh, also, real quick, Jacob. I'm gonna use, um... Yeah, fuck it, also, just Jacob use real... Analyzer. Jacob, Jacob, real quick. Uh... This is how I rank Engage right now. Yeah. Your FE tier list. Yes. Um. Runs the fence up again. I think that's uh Earth, right? Yeah, the no. Wait, that's that's not speed up. No, no, that was, that was defender. I mean, to be honest, listing every single title would be tedious, so I thought I'd make it quick to prove a point. Fucking Mac Rider. <laughs> Spoiler alert, we're gonna have to fight him at least one more time after all this. Oh, fun. Don't worry, I'll be way later. <laughs> oh, out of magic. We could probably beat him without magic. Yeah, but I think you might help. Because I'm at the funny number. Yeah, and he's fucking dead! <laughs> I knew it! Yep, never mind. <laughs> fucking knew that would kill him. Oh, each boss probably gets easy. That's really disappointing. He was scared off. They really do. Help. Oh no, he oh, healed. I better go. <laughs> I'm sorry, I helped. I helped with that 69 before I heal. 69. Uh oh. Time for the fun thing. I'm gonna burn it's up this whole place. We're finished. Escape sequence. What's that sound? Jacob, I thought you knew the number was. Hello! That's truffle. I thought you knew the... Jacob, I thought the number that you knew was 256. Well, you have 256 health. <laughs> You don't have 69. Nobody has 69. Yeah, I That's funny. Alright. And why is it playing happy music? <laughs> yeah, because King Truffle's here to save us. Am I too late? Do you want to know how I came here? Whip. By Flammy! Hey, he grew like a weed and started to fly. So yeah, we're flying now. Hey, Jacob, look, if you want hey, happy whip. music play... Play the Hotel Mario theme. <laughs> I didn't know what to do, so I just hopped on. Whip. Keep whip. I'm gonna keep whipping you. Strange, but he thinks you're his parents. I guess he wants to help you. Whip. Take this flabby drum. It's his favorite toy. Give me a second, I have to switch to okay. microphone quality. Use it anywhere and he'll come to you. Whip. Now take me to Batongo. It's to the southwest. Whip. Okay, does this Fly sound better? Out. Okay. Yeah, sounds better. Okay, good. I thought you couldn't hear me for a second. Mode 7 graphics! Oh wow, this is way faster. This looks exactly like fucking FF6. Jacob, I'm sure this game released after... Wait, are you FF6. actually controlling the dragon? Uh, no. Right or, is this, or is this a cutscene? Yeah, uh, we're, we're controlling him. we got fast travel now. Holy shit! It took us halfway into the game to get fast travel. Yeah. That's amazing. This game, you know what? This game is actually poorly designed. You know what I mean, like, besides the cannons. Oh, yeah. Hang on, hang on. Hard to tell where to go when these things aren't labeled, like, in the remake, though. I imagine this is way easier in the remake, right? 
At least I can actually tell where your my characters are labeled. Oh, are they yeah. are they also labeled in the remake? Uh, yeah, like a little text popped up when you're above something. Oh. Uh, what? You can pan the camera. Okay. Uh, and yeah, it means towering up. Oh, oh. What's this? Okay. <laughs> that might be it. I think this might be the go. Yeah, yeah. Hold on, Jose, I gotta raise your volume. Alright, are you on, are you gonna get on my parsec? Okay. That's what I'm telling you, you dummy! You Sorry. dick shit! Sorry, I didn't hear you. Alright. I hate you, Jacob, I hate you so freaking much. <laughs> <laughs> you are such a dipshit. How do you like riding Flammy? When you get lost up there, use his special powers. Press start to see the map. Hell and R buttons to change modes. You'll find the lofty mountains to the southwest. What you seek is there. Visit me again, yeah, the, okay? Yeah, the mountains is my favorite grinding spot. Oh, okay. So yeah, now I can just use his rattle and fly around. Ooh, okay. Yeah. You just get a dragon. Okay, now, I, now, I gotta, now I gotta fix your audio. <laughs> Again, hold on. Why? Why do you gotta fix my audio for? Uh, you're super loud. It, it was it was quiet and then it was loud. What the hell? Did you just make up your mind already? Okay, now it's good. What is this yeah. map? This oh. is a poorly designed map. Since okay. when did this become Final Fantasy? That's what I was saying. Okay, now where the heck are this dragon became an airship. Okay. That's... This okay. is literally Final Fantasy airship. Okay, I think the mounds are over here. Jacob, isn't it common for all Final Fantasy games to have airships? Yeah. Okay, there we go. Er, Woo! Well, we're at the village. Like, even, where are we? Like, it even happened in one of the medieval Final Fantasy games. Well, we're at a village on the mountain. Like, one, two, five. Have we been here before? Oh, no, we have not oh. been here. Yeah, welcome to the place of the weird monks. The sage jock lives high atop the mountain. Yeah, we're going to... Final Fantasy VI, I wouldn't even consider this it This temple medieval, dates like... from the Mono Fortress War. The orbs inside store data from that period. The ancients called them, uh, videos, I think. BDM. Final Fantasy VI literally started to stay away from the, from the medieval stuff in favor of steampunk. For like, steampunk I, I, I do like the steampunk. Gazaza beep. Zega Zega. This one's broken. Final Fantasy VII, however, they started to go all out for the modern world. There, you can see the Mana Beast just moments before it go. It hit hit the fortress. Oh, it's coming this way. We're going off the... Is it ancient? <laughs> I'm in trend in the 90s. Yeah, they shift from medieval to modern world days. Well, that's not quite the word I use for that, but... <laughs> and, uh, yeah. Our next destination is finding that jock sage the guy mentioned. Oh, okay. So, hey, a little we're bit gonna be on a wild goose chase for him for a while. Oh, Jacob. Can we go to the shop? Yeah, we the shop. What do you think here. of my ranking? Or engage. Did you put I, in the trade chat or something? I got a DM. I'll I'll check the DM. Oh. Okay. I'll, I'll let you do the I'll let you do the shop while I uh look at it. Ooh, new armor. Yeah, very expensive armor. Good lord. What? You know, what? buy buy a uh, buy the magical armor for Nyarl, <laughs> and then we'll just stick with the uh we'll stick with the tiger armor for now. Let's see, okay, um, Shadow Dragon, Radiant Dawn, Shadows of Valentia, Binding Blade, and Path of Radiance in S tier. Those are my top five favorites. Obviously, Genealogy is placed in front because it's my number one favorite. Oh wait, that's Genealogy, not Shadow Dragon, I'm stupid. No, that's Genealogy. It's ranked number one for a reason. It's a that's Shadow Radiant Dawn is ranked... Radiant Dawn is ranked second, Valentia third, Binding Blade fourth, and Path of Radiance fifth. 
has a good list. For for sixth place, it's Mystery of the Emblem, the original. Ooh, okay. And my current ranking for Engage is seventh place. Is there anything else we need to buy? Uh, I don't think we can afford much. <laughs> Right. Yeah. That should be good. <laughs> oh, yeah, you got new armor, Jose. Yep. Hey, Jacob, you wouldn't be surprised why the bottom two are the worst. Uh, dude, can I put that there? Is that Fates and... What is that? Right. Gaiden. Oh, Gaiden. Yeah. Basically, Fire Emblem 2. Oh, I see. Mm -hmm. oh, yeah, uh, before we... why, Bert... Jose. What? Before you leave, can you put on your armor? Oh yeah, that's right. Give me a sec. The reason why Ber Fire Emblem Fates Birthrights is my least favorite is because it's too simple. Is that why you want and me to play the funny meme mod? <laughs> yes. <laughs> I want us to play the funny meme mod after Radiant Dawn. Gotcha. Honestly, I was originally going to put Gaiden as my worst. Because... Where's the armor? Oh, you also got uh, a helmet. The yeah, the ruby armor. Yeah, also you got a magical armor to put on for your body slot. Oh yeah, the reason, why I, the reason why I put Gaiden as the second worst is because it's a very slow game. Yeah, you gotta put the that more to put on, dude. The mechanics on that game is very slow and too grindy. You got a bit more to put on your body slot. And it's on NES. Oh yeah, and Jacob. What? You'd be surprised why Shadow Dragon and the Blade of Light is a bit higher than Gaiden. Well, put on your armor and we can talk about it. <laughs> What armor? Your body armor. I go into go into a flip, then press up. See the blue armor? There you go. Wow, that's an amazing increase. <laughs> oh yeah, I should probably go sell his old stuff. Do now. I have to put anything else? No, nope, that's it. Not at the moment. Probably go oh, sell yeah, that stuff though. You want to hear my reasoning why I would have put Gaiden at the very bottom? Why? Like I said, the game is very slow and clunky. Slower than Path of Radiance? Yes. Good Lord, and, I can imagine that. And that game is too grindy. You have to grind most of your allies. Yeah, I don't like that either. <laughs> oh yeah, and the game... The, running the game even at 100% is extremely slow. You have to run the game at 300... At 300 speed, to make the game seem faster. Good god. <laughs> mm-hmm. Yeah, it's a very boring game to play. Yeah, like Yuffie. <laughs> Just be grateful that we have a remake of that game. Don't know who's gonna play that one yet. Oh, I'm definitely gonna play the remake, because Zeppi doesn't even want to play the remake of Shadows of Valentia. Yeah, I think he's gonna play- I think he's gonna play Awakening and Base Fates, and then you'll play the Fates mod, and then Shadows of Valentia. Trust me, Jacob. The oh, Fates wait, mod is gonna be really fun. <laughs> but you do need- the only- like, the only way to work- to make this game work is that you need the special edition of Fates. I had that once. Also, why am I tripped? Well, okay, that's good. Uh, the flower put you to sleep. I swear to god, this game is like and fucking you have to brawl play sometimes. The, and you have to play through the conquest What's mode. <laughs> and the jokes and the jokes on that game is actually really funny. You're gonna hear constant bald jokes. Oh hell yeah. Stop, <laughs> stop, this isn't brawl, stop tripping me. <laughs> brawl. Get blown up by the bomb bees. I'd rather get blown up than get tripped. Oh yeah, Jacob, we are getting close to the end of the month. Yeah, which means it's gonna be Black History Month next month. That's true. Hmm. You know what, I'm not gonna use any magic. 
Honestly, the only magic you really need to use is Fire Bouquet. Because that's your only offensive move right now. That's actually, like, really good. So, Jacob, I mean, are you... Yeah. So, Jacob, are you surprised that engages my seventh favorite Fire Emblem game? That quickly, huh? <laughs> yep. Uh, that cave is the next, uh, Magna Palace, by the way. Okay. You should also... Around here, then, first. Hey, Jacob, you should also notice that Three Houses is my third least favorite Fire Emblem game. Let's, let's head back to the village first. So for, for a good okay. reason. My only reason for disliking the... disliking Three Houses is the monastery. It... It literally acts as your main hub. I think, I think the sawmill is a better hub than the monastery. Yeah. Because in the monastery, it t it takes so long to get used to, because you have to constantly talk to many people, and you have to wait for a few days, weeks, months to get to the next chapter. Yep. <laughs> and what's even worse is that you have to play all four paths. Good lord. Yeah, that alone is horribly tedious. And even oh. Fates didn't even go that far. <laughs> Welcome back to the Fire Welcome back to the Fire Emblem podcast with Secret Amana gameplay. <laughs> Great. Oh yeah, and Jacob, I've recruited new char new characters and engage. More bosses. No. Just regular ones like Gold Mary, for example. Do the, the Dark Palace. Okay, screw these enemies. But yeah, I recruited Gold I recruited Gold Mary today. Yeah! Our voluptuous queen. Uh, I transformed the voluptuous queen into something else. What the fuck is that thing? I don't even know. Oh god, my eyes. Hey, Jacob, you wanna know what Gold Mary has become? What? I'm... She became Tifa. Honestly, pretty fitting. <laughs> Specifically, the Advent Children one. That's the best, or that's the best Tifa, honestly. Why? I like the black outfit on her. <laughs> and I dyed Gold Mary's hair black as well. Perfect. Or is it brown? And, it's like a darkish brown. Yeah, I'd go for. Yeah, I honestly went for black hair. What are those NA supposed to be? Uh, you old face or something like that. I'm gonna call them goblins. Also, I forgot who the dan- <laughs> I forgot who the dancer's name was. Uh, I already forgot. He's very forgettable. But I do know that he did- That he did, uh, have the Corin em- The emblem Corin. Oh yeah, that's right. Also, this dungeon's kinda reminding a bit of Link to the Past level design. Why is that? It reminds me of, like, the first castle that you're in. That makes sense. At the start of the game. Gnarly's level 30! Hooray! Gnarly's not moving. <laughs> oh yeah, that's right. I like this dungeon already. This look- although, I will admit, the dungeon design or like the palette. It reminds me of the shit that I've made. Oh yeah, his name was like Seagull. Oh yeah, oh, yeah Se I like Seagull. Like your Limbo full Mario RPG problem. I turned him into yeah, Joker. Yeah, you still remember that. <laughs> yeah. Hey Jacob, I turned him into Joker from Persona 5. <laughs> what? He's a dancer. And oh, yeah. Joker... oh yeah, so Jordan, if you don't get if you don't get what we're talking about, Jose installed a bunch of Persona 5 outfits to engage. <laughs> And he's dressing yeah. up the characters like Persona 5 characters. Yep. So I thought that Seagull <laughs> would look more like Joker from Persona 5. I, think I can see it. Think about this. Joker... Joker fights in style. You know, you have a good point. And he has... And he actually dances in one of the dancing games. 
Uh, well, that's a bit- that's stretching it a bit, but yeah. <laughs> Why stretching it a bit? Oh, pull pack, track, really loud. Trying to pull sources material from the fucking fighting games. What? You guys kinda remind me of- They're doing fucking, like, DK Sword Smash. Fire! Okay, can I move? I'd love to- I'd love to move. I wouldn't say that oh, right. Persona 5 oh, isn't dead canon, end. but at the same time, it kind of is. Oh, textures. Textures kind of bugged out. Wait a minute, wait, wait, hang on, hang on, hang on. I think I see something I can do. Uh, wait, no. Never mind, I'm stupid. Yeah, we okay. went the wrong way. Okay, so for some reason, I thought there was a thing I could- wait, there is a thing I could- Not right now, but there will be. Oh. Now you're gonna be what? what the- uh, ignore that. <laughs> Become Indiana Jones. Okay, let's move. And I'm on fire. Okay, so we do have to come back there later. Wait. I have I have the right idea. I so what kind of dumb ideas you, are you thinking of? Uh, you should probably heal Ho um, probably heal him, Jose. Hold on, I'll just, I'll just use the chocolate. Okay. Uh, you'll need your magic later. This I guess place that's fair. This place's boss is weak to fire, so... I got you. We'll just be able to spam our fire bouquets all day long. I won't be able to do anything, because I suck. Hey, Jeff, <laughs> you want to hear something funny? I like this boss at the same suck. Imagine if <laughs> Final Fantasy VII Remake Part 3 releases before the new <laughs> the new Nintendo console. <laughs> <laughs> just imagine that. <laughs> That would- I would immediately make fun of Nintendo for that. Can't wait for the Nintendo Switch 10. <laughs> the Nintendo Switch 10. First game, Final Fantasy 7 Remake Part 3 that will release on the Nintendo Switch 2. Nah, man, they're gonna make like a really crusty port on only the Nintendo Switch and not the Switch 2. For no reason. Final Fantasy VII Remake Afterbirth Hurts. Big up, I am water. hoping that the new Nintendo exactly. console will run at 60 frames per second. Okay, let's... Okay, now where the hell are we supposed to go? I forget. Nintendo, and I also want... Nintendo are... Switch somewhere. You know, Jacob? You know what oh, would be nice? Okay, here we go. Hey, yeah, Jacob, you wanna know what would be nice? What's up here? Is this another uh, trap game? Game? Oh, okay. That's, it would be nice really if... Fucking Nintendo... Would... Uh, make the new console as powerful as the PS4. That's what people are saying. Well, people are saying it's gonna be somewhere in between the power of a PS4 and a PS5. That would be nice, actually. That's what I want from Nintendo. If oh, that's what the specs. That's what we have to go by with what the specs are. If the specs are very good, then then fine. I would immediately buy that if the specs are good. Die just as long head. as the Fierce game head. runs. Okay. Just, see their just name as long now. as the frames are good. Yeah, honestly, that's the only thing I'd want from a new Switch. Just have every game be able to run in 60 finally. I mean, Jacob, we don't know if it is a Switch. It could be Nintendo might go back to their uh, freaking roots of a home console. I mean, not really, because people are already saying there's gonna be metallic or magnetic Joy-Cons or the fuck. Uh, all I'm just saying is that it would be nice if it's... The only thing I've seen that If it is a home console. Out. I just kind of miss the home console. Me too. Uh, aspects for Nintendo. There we go. Now, oh, being able to send... Being able to sit in front of a couch to play something is always nice. Exactly. I mean, if you I'm know, gonna be honest with you, you know, I'm not on the couch. <laughs> I mean, yeah. Jacob, if I'm gonna be honest with you, I was already disappointed with the specs of the Nintendo Switch. I mean, it's 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 like almost eight-year-old hardware. What are you gonna do at this point? It's literally, it literally has the same hardware as the PlayStation Two. Uh, it Where was it again? I think it was in here. Which, which I could also nope. argue that. Which I could also argue yourself. that the PS2 oh. is even more powerful than the Switch itself. No. 
I mean, the PS2 is 480p, the Switch is 1080. Okay, Dave, now I we can bolt across. Dave, I could assure you that that the Nintendo Switch can't handle a PS2 game. An upscaled PS2 game. <laughs> exactly. Mind you. Well, that's my that's point. It's upscaled. I'm... Different story. Is there anything in here? No, that's just the uh, pure standard again. Yeah, I know you have to. A lot of backtracking in this dungeon. Yeah. We call, that's what we call a blood room. But the thing is, is that once you're on emulation with the PS2, it's a diff it's also a different story. You could literally make the resolution whatever the hell you want. Yeah. I could finally, I could finally play Family Feud in 1080p. <laughs> yeah, I can play Xenosaga <laughs> the best way possible with even if it even if it doesn't rain. Run at 60 frames, because to me, I don't think I don't think Xenosaga was meant to run at 60 frames. And I'm saying engage that. wasn't either, and we have it running at 60 now. It's pretty awesome. When I tried to use the 60 frame cheat codes for Xenosaga, it looks terrible. Oh. <laughs> it literally does look terrible. It feels like I'm playing the game fast, fast forward. It doesn't even feel natural. Honestly, I might I might play the TTYD remake 60 FPS because I I noticed the, I was looking at the footage and the game looks very slow and choppy. Yes. Jacob, it really depends on what on what the people use to make it look like it is at 60 FPS. Yeah, last fight they had uh, because sometimes, in my opinion. Sometimes 60 frames can be can look really choppy if it's not done right. Yeah, I suppose. Fire at least, oh, I at love least getting a golden fire. Alright, you know what? Fuck these guys. At least that's how we see it anyways. Ooh, wow, fancy. Yeah, so was... Jacob. That's, uh... Have you ever played any game where 60 FPS kind of looks choppy? Ooh, wow, look at this boss. Up into the dark slide. Yeah. What Earth the slide. hell is that thing? Earth. Yeah, spam fire the game. Fire? Fire! Yeah. Yeah. yeah, fire bouquet is definitely the way to go here. Also, he's gonna keep getting bigger. Oh. Just Reminds me of that fucking slime boss from Yoshi's Island. I also, the, also the colors are crap, let you know. Joshi's Island. I genuinely don't know how this guy even attacks. Okay, now this is becoming real choppy right now. Or, no, if I had this one that strength, actually. There's... There's too much going on. <laughs> yeah, I know... I, I noticed the pallets are, like... Logging out on the bottom screen. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> the colors, they don't know what to do. Fire gate level five. Fire gate. Wow. I didn't realize I would have gotten the most boring role in Secret Mana. The whip boy. Why? <laughs> why get why get a boring role? You guys you get all this cool ass magic and I just have to whip people. Yeah, it's like the right side. When we get to the final boss, it'll be. And I thought that I was gonna have a really boring role. Will be more. Yeah. It'll be more interesting when I get to the final boss. I mean, that in the sense of you'll be the only one that can do damage. Oh, so I have plot armor. Gotcha. More like you we'll have, have to enchant your sword. You have plot armor. Oh. Oh. oh, so this guy can attack. It looks like I don't have. Oh. Magic points anymore. That's good. And I'm poisoned. Oh okay, yeah, I That's think it's fine to use good. a fairy walnut. Yeah, and I, I need to heal first. Okay. I mean, we'll see if I kill him before you uh, do magic. Yeah, I remember just like stop locking and stick to him and chicken or anything. Also, I kind of misremembered that. We'll fight. We'll fight a three player or a four player. Take damage. Hey, Jay, hmm. look, I'm not moving. You got, like, stoned or something. <laughs> yeah, I got stoned. 
Oh, he's red now. Yeah. Ooh. Yeah. You you might want to heal. Let me do something fun. They wanna have fun. Also, Dick, you still have MP. Come on, let me do something fun. You're oh, taking wait. the spotlight, damn it. Okay, cool. Yeah, I think he's about to die. It quickly stopped working. Come on. Yeah, it's not letting you do magic. Why is it not letting me do magic? He's about to die. Yep, yeah, he's, he, he's dead. Well, you got, you got some magic off before the battle ended. Guess he didn't need a heal after all. Oh uh, yeah, and, uh, this next dude, next man. And I just survived with a low amount of HP. Just look at my health points. Yeah. Way to go! Gnarly reaches level 31. Um, oh, yeah. okay, I was walking in place. Got Javelin Orb. And all right. now we got Shade. Shade? I am the, I am the spirit of dark, the darkness and an elemental of man. You have well, to be I'm leaving. Take my powers mm -hmm. as a reward. Come on, just let me leave. Ooh. And by you, they talking to these people sound boring. So you guys have dark magic now? I do. Just you? Gnarly doesn't yep. get it. You only oh. have light ma- What? I mean, you only have dark magic. Yeah. When will I have light magic? Okay, how's I need you? I need, I need you come up here. <laughs> you'll, you'll get your light magic later. No, really. So you get dark magic. And nearly gets light magic. Yep. Interesting. Okay, that's it. Uh, uh, let me and you'll get one with lasers. Yay, lasers! Gonna be the, gonna have. Wait, a better idea. Oh yeah, right. <laughs> Keep <forgetting laughs> about the lasers world. even. Why is lasers even a thing? All right. Yeah. We need we need to go upgrade our weapons. Oh yeah. Is the guy in town? Uh, is the is, yeah? Is the guy back in town? I don't think he's in the mountain town at all. <laughs> More. Yep, so we just go wherever and uh, figure out where I'm going. So glad oh, we have wait. fast travel now. Anyways, like... Yeah, we don't have to face some asshole. That we can go into a cannon. Dude, we got quite a lot done this episode already. We got two we bosses. We got pay. like two dungeons done already. We are not. We are not gonna pay for some asshole to go into a cannon to fast travel. Yeah. Instead, we're gonna pay a a, a, a not asshole dragon. Yeah, a that dragoon. That we raise kind of. Okay, well, let's upgrade. Yeah, I mean it shouldn't be that expensive to upgrade them. Blue claw, two. Chakra hand. Chakra hand. Blow jammer. Fork of hope. <laughs> Isn't that just a trident? Hey Jacob. Uh, Imp Imp Sport. Sport. We Rising were meant to one. move at. Two. Hey Jacob, we were meant to move at 30 <laughs> FPS. <laughs> Great bow. Bow, bow, bow pulp. And the whip. Chain whip. No, there's no such thing um, as frames. The flail of hope. Isn't that just a vampire killer? <laughs> Lale Hope becomes Morning Star. Yeah, I have an I have an actual Morning Star now. Why do you even have a Morning Star? Vampire killer joke. Battle of Axe Apple. becomes Golden Apple. Axe. Apple. Copyright not intended. <laughs> I wonder when we'll hear about that revival eventually again. <laughs> I right, definitely save after that. Oh yeah. yeah. Uh, yeah, now I just got up a set of mountain to go try and talk to that uh, sage doctor or something. I told the sage doctor I was in love with you. Mode 7 graphics. Alright, let's go talk to the witch doctor. I'm guessing he's up the mountain, right? Yep. 
No, stop brawl. Stop Smash Bros. brawling me, bro. And we gotta fight past the horde of flowers and ants. Or bees. So rude. Also explosive. Oh yeah, now you remember those uh, chickens with the eggs on their back now? <laughs> uh, maybe. Uh, normally you'd run into them first here rather than at the Wind Palace. Oh, interesting. Yeah, here they are. These guys. And I'm stoned. Petrification sucks so hard. Man, I already need to heal. Honestly, the worst part is that it just deals massive damage to you every time you get inflicted with it. Well, if, um, if one of us gets petrified, can't we just, like, use a medical herb? Yeah, but the damage is honestly the worst part. Yeah. Also, lucky for you, you're gonna get plenty of use of your whip here. Yay, my whip! And I gotta stop getting Smash Bros. Brawl, dude. This sucks. Especially, especially since we're gonna be doing this a lot. Man, I'm really glad I mained the whip. <laughs> Because, uh, spoiler now, we're gonna be on a wild goose chase for Jocks. Wow. This is the whip episode. Hell no. Nah. Sleep flower. Stop Smash Bros brawling me, dude! Guys, I think this- I think we know what this flower's favorite Smash Bros. game is. That's some nice music, too. It's not as good as the Seinfeld dungeon theme, though. Ooh. Oh, what the heck? Bird up! Oh, that's fine with me. Go away! The Sage yeah. is out! Where is Jock? Sage Jock left far, left for the Gold Isle. It's northeast of here. Yeah. Now we're heading for the Gold Isle, which, if I recall correctly, is another one of the places that's heavily affected by that. Oh, thank God we can get there easily now. We can get there at all, honestly. Yeah. We need to figure out where the heck it is. Yeah, because the mode 7 does not do it justice. Either that or you can switch modes and do it that way. <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't think that's gonna work. This doesn't help either. <laughs> the gold isles? No, that's just Matongo again. Oh, that, that's not Matongo, that's a different place. Though. Is that Gold Isles? Uh, I think this might be the Turtle Isles thing, then. Right. Well, there's okay. a house here. Um, okay, yeah. I'm back. Oh, wait, never mind. That's the lighthouse. The I lighthouse? I to talk to people. I love there's nothing... To people. There's nothing I much important yeah. to it. There's a monk at the top of it, too. Basically, people oh. knows me. Well... He's spinning! I'm, I'm Picard, the part. caretaker of this lighthouse. I am well known in this To the world. northeast is a coral reef. Under it lies the sunken continent. The monoplow, this is really, really a switch that will re refloat the continent. Did the you power, say Suikoden? The power of the ancients must have been incredible. No, um, I did not guys, know Guys, you're incredibles. Jacob, I did not know Aerith was in this game. I don't know either. <laughs> And I also thought Ooh. you said Suikoden. You mean Suikoden? Yeah. <laughs> Isn't that what Psycho Mantis just said? I don't know. Well, does, he say, well, does he say that in MGS1? Well, if he you reads your memory cards... You play Suikoden. Okay, this gives me a bit of a better view. Oh, thank God. I mean, you actually kind of got that quote right, Jacob. Oh, yeah, because I don't. Oh, is that, is that it? Uh, maybe. Might as well check. It's, act it's actually a JRPG franchise made by Konami. Is this it? I, I, I think it's so, actually. It would explain all the yellow. Hmm. You know, maybe I should try out 
uh, JRPGs that were made by Konami. Right, what do you have? Oh my god, new armor already! Actually, I don't know. Missouri ring. The battle suit. <laughs> black, black, black helmet. Flower suit. Oh yeah, and Jacob. We can't afford any of this. Remember that when we DM, you real you literally went a wooga all, all over Queen Ginger Ale. I yeah, think this might actually be the best equipment that's not specifically by the best equipment in the game. I've not dropped <laughs> my hand. Wow. Specifically, when you see her in the freaking Numa outfit. I mean, you could buy you could buy um one of those bracelets maybe. I could imagine that you were all saying like, "God damn, that's some bust." God damn. I guess buy it for either you or Gnarly. Oh yeah, and Jabe, you know what I just realized? What? <laughs> Queen Ginger Ale has a bigger bust size than Lear. I mean, Pepsi Chan. Well, check out that defense increase. Dang. <laughs> they are busting Pepsi, John. Yep. Pepsi, man. She has... You know what? Oh, Basically, what I'm trying to say is that Queen Ginger Ale has bigger booba than Coke, John. I, I already got the dude. <laughs> no, I'm not going to do that. <laughs> and that's yeah. why I gave Queen Ginger Ale the Numa outfit. I approve. Brew does approve. Locked. <laughs> rude disapprove, and it's <laughs> locked. What do you say, rude does approve? Yeah, yeah. Honestly, I forget where we're supposed to go, assuming it hasn't been changed by the time. Oh yeah, and Jacob, there was also something that I got to tell you. Not a heal, though. Have you ever heard of a song called "Ignorance Is Bliss"? That's a song. Isn't that That's just a saying? <laughs> no, it's a song. It's actually oh, right. a, it's actually a song actually produced by Nintendo. What? What the what? Oh, the weapons guys in here. Cool. Uh, what was it produced for? Uh, oh, I, <laughs> I was literally using the joystick. I did that once by accident this stream too. <laughs> Oh, that's the uh, very win there. You got anything to say? This is the Empire's Gold City. Yeah, we're in the right place. There's no one nowhere to go. Oh, wow. I'm Too expensive to live here? It's like Vancouver. <laughs> you know what, Jacob? I'm just going to post this music video just in case for reference. Oh, that's that's oh. the shop. Okay. I'm, I'm really in town. When I say ignorance is bliss. This whole island is made of gold. And yeah. it's already sent. What over here? King Mammon lives here. The first floor is a hotel. I guess we can heal. Secret of Mana featuring Jose and a guy in group DM. Wow, Jordan, you've been demote you've been demoted to just a guy. <laughs> <laughs> hey Jacob, check your DM. And Moonness the Tenchi Sim. Alright, let's have a look. Ignorance is bliss jellyfish. I it's actually a real that. song made by Nintendo. What was it made for? Was it was it on like a, a record or something in the nineties? Yeah, what? it was. A, it was a record on the nineties. How the fuck did I nail that? But somehow, but somehow people like me in the two thousands remember this from my childhood. Oh, I went there. Pretty sure everyone here is a two thousand. Also, why are you guys running? Yeah. Where the heck we're supposed to be going right now. To get places quicker. I can't even run. I'm very slow. Uh, I there's, have a run button. there's a button you gotta hold to run. I forget which one it is. Oh, there you there go. go. Yeah, oh, we're all it's, running. It's the A button. Yeah. Well, look, come over it here has, though. It has to be charged <laughs> up much like it's like. I'm running. Yeah. I was like... <laughs> comedic, comedic, uh, comedic effect. 
Also, this is going to get annoying quickly. Wait, what do you have to say? I think that's the most annoying. King Mammon sealed off the light palace at the edge of town. No one knows what's in that tower. That old fisherman likes to tell stories about it. Exit the city of Southwest. He lives at the end of the coastal path. Southwest, also, Jacob, huh? this is gonna. Also, Ronnie. Also, Jacob, this uh, this run button will be annoying really quickly. Why is that? That's okay. Can't change direction. Because, because when you turn around to a different direction, you stop running. Yeah, yeah that's, I, that's I find that annoying. Yeah, Southwest. So it's not worth it. It's not bad, it's just everybody has to be in sync and running at the same time. I just don't like it. Hmm, power this, here. The snake kid? There, Ignorance is bliss. Oh, oh yeah, this. that's it. Uh, There's hey, look, the castle of the... Taznica. Hey look, Tazna. it's the Morty guards. Yeah, the wrong place. <laughs> oh. The Morty guards. <laughs> Jeez, dude. Um, make sure you're Haven't facing southwest. Haven't they been southwest. thrown off ever since Path of Radiance? The Morty guys are- the guards are always Funny. Oh, they are Funny, like the Boonie. Mm-hmm. <laughs> funny, Boonie. Is that it? Nope. Oh, we're back yeah, to- just... We wrapped back around yeah. again. Yeah, we have a kind of full circle. Hmm. Like, anyway, we're just looking like- Maybe just look at the guide or something, because I'm a okay. little lost here. Wait, wait, wait. Can you, uh, look a little bit past the, uh, can you look a little bit around? What is that little building over there? What, what little building? There's like a little dot there. This? Yeah, what is that? Uh, nothing. Oh, you can't go there? Weird. Oh. Strange. Okay, um... We'll be back, I gotta look at the guide. Okay, I guess we'll go south then. Uh, honestly, I'm not sure if this will even apply here, because that did not mention a fisherman. Weird. You're so weird. In the right place. <laughs> Who said oh, that? Oh, oh this is the cast. This is the, the witch's castle. Oh, well, so, Jacob, that's not where we want to be. When are you gonna invite me to play? Toho. Okay. Lost 10. Uh, probably some gonna... probably sometime next week. That's okay. Pandora. I'm gonna play some of my favorite characters on that game, even though it doesn't have Moko. That's Moko's. um. Yeah, that's that's the Tongo again. There's no Moko or Letty White Rock in that game. Sad. What's that There's place no... over there? They are not in Bohemian Rhapsody. <laughs> I think that's just the fairy village. You know what, Jacob? That's what oh. I'm gonna call it right now. I'm gonna call it Toho Bohemian Rhapsody. <laughs> Honestly, I also thought of that joke. Yeah, oh, yeah that's, the, really that's the desert why? village. Looks well, like you and I have the same joke about the Queen song. Yep. Oh, and do FE7 Link Arena. True. Oh, I Did you say FE7? Yeah, I really don't know where we should go. Well, it said go north of the Golden Town, so... Okay, this is the ice place. Yeah. Hmm. Okay, here we go. You found it? Actually, no, I, I thought that was over here. Oh, wait, yeah. no, actually, Have we been here? Oh, wait, never mind. This is the ruins place. Oh. And, yeah, it felt found to be around here somewhere. Oh my god, why are we gonna travel? Faster! <laughs> this is so boring! Here we go. Okay, okay, now I'm starting to have even less fun with Secret of Mana. Anyway... Oh no, anyway. Okay, so, here we go. Please let this be correct and the acting change something. I know who you are. Eh? Jermis friends, right? See, I'm really a Tazakin spy. So was my husband till he got caught. I'm continuing his work. Easter, enter North Town from the Resident Sewerway east of here. Give the guard his secret number, 634. I have a Some, question. Yep, something different. Why does he look like a palm tree? 
<laughs> no one, man. He oh, looks boy. like a silver palm tree. So we gotta go east, they said. Damn, Jacob, I do not know we can we can talk to palm trees. Palm tree panic. Oh, God. Yes. Bad. Yes, this is basically palm tree panic. Okay, so yeah, we're basically running blind now because the hack changed something. This is so boring. Oh. Thank you for being helpful here. Wouldn't it be nice if this game... Do you, you know what sewer fun? they're talking about? I have no idea. Do you have any idea where you're going? Not at all. Nope. You dumbass. <laughs> what can I say? The hack changed something. Yeah. Okay, I guess let's just go try and find the empty to talk to Well, thank you for making me hate Secret of Mana even more. Whatever. Again, if this was the normal game, we'd be flying and dandy right now, but I don't know where to go right now. Hmm. I don't know what coastal they're talking about. Yeah, I don't know either. I didn't realize that was something that was changed in this version. You know, I don't think we'll ever finish this game. I think we're gonna play this game for eternal for eternity. Anyway, let's well we took the actual south part of town. Maybe there's a path over here or something. Or maybe yeah, maybe. Be... This game has that... officially become Well, not this part of town, that's for sure. <laughs> this game has a... officially became South Park season thirty. Here? I think I saw a guard with a gate over here. Dang. Yeah, here we go. Yeah. You have to save for yourself. <laughs> yeah, there's I don't remember this. Here's a new place. Hey, hey look, it's the cat from uh, Alice in Wonderland. There. That's a wolf. It looks like a cat. Yeah, not really. <laughs> It literally looks like the cat from Alice in Wonderland. So wait, are you saying are you saying this this area is completely new to this hack? Yeah, I yeah. don't remember this at all. Beast, oh. Although the beast zombie that is a new. Yeah, you're 69. Yeah, that uh, enemy is a <laughs> new, but there he is. Ah, gotcha. You literally, you literally done 69 damage to yep. a cat from Alice in Wonderland. <laughs> Is Alice Margaret White in there? Oh god, it's Black Slime. I think this is the... Oh yeah, this is the Mimic. Jacob, Alice Margaret White is not here. Or at the Shapeshifter. Yeah. These these guys just spawn in enemies. A bunch of enemies. No, I, I do not she, want to deal with she, that. I'm, I'm, actually, because, I'm actually fucking dead. Before. She's not here because the game is so bad. Hey, what the... I'm letting you use magic? Oh. Lead oh, drop. Oh, they're called lead drops here. Uh, in the remake, they're called shape shifters. <laughs> <laughs> maybe, maybe you should just forget about them. You know, I don't know why I'm here. laughing for some reason. For some reason, I am laughing right oh, now. God. That guy did 169 damage. Great bite. Oh, also, the game is glitching. Great job. Oh. Uh, What's that? Yeah, oh. the game is the game is glitching. I saw it that time. Yeah, magic seems to cause weird stuff to happen sometimes. Oh, we we set the wolf on fire, and I'm dead. I wasn't watching my health there. I was also not watching my health. Hey, I'm somewhere nearby. <laughs> on the way. Thank you. And now I'm dead. <laughs> <laughs> Why do you keep dying? These wolves are annoying, bro. Uh, dude, you're in control of the sprite right now. Make them their cats. What? Fuck sake. Why does it do that? Ed, you might want to heal yourself. Help, help, Jose. Well, guys, you always... guys have to waste your magic. On these cats. Maybe I keep saying that. <laughs> anyway. Also, did I see a troll face? You mean the slime? I swear I'm not crazy. They these look like troll faces. Oh yeah, Jose, Zeppy's telling you to stop complaining. <laughs> what? He's telling you he's telling you to stop complaining and play engage instead. 
Jacob, I have every right to complain about this game. It's not even that good. So, to the people who are watching, stop... <laughs> stop telling me what to not do. <laughs> I can complain whenever I want. So leave me alone. More doggies. Yeah, lately they charge they up. look like cats. I did not see it. They literally look like cats. This looks like a wolf to me. It's a cat. It's a cat from Alice in Wonderland. Oh, it's a rescan of the wolf enemies we fought in the ice place. Oh. Where are these guys supposed to show up normally? Uh, in the gold tower we're supposed to be going to normally. Oh, okay. Okay. Awesome. Such For a my realization, I, I wish I could play Engage right now. Well, yeah, well see, maybe, but... maybe maybe we can make it to the gold tower and then call it a day. Good. We should oh, make it there. Area. Yeah, this area is pretty long, <laughs> to be fair. Okay. Yeah. Uh, so why I... am I getting healed? Why am I getting healed? Because you were at critical health. <laughs> Ten no, health. I wasn't. I was at perfect condition. <laughs> you were at 28. 10 health is pretty 20... perfect condition. <laughs> 28. Is that is that a funny number? Oh, 28? Oh, oh, okay. Oh, oh. Yeah. I'm fucking dead again, because that guy does like 100 that's, damage. That's, you know, that's actually a good thing that you're dead. Not good. Okay. Did we make Can it? Can we find a decent hotel? Uh, okay. Is this a hotel? I think we found the fisherman or whatever. The gold tower key? You're not the only one who asks about it today. Oh. That sword? You're Jarma's friends. I'll tell you all about it. Fifteen years ago, I used a fishing boat to help a man reach South Town. When I sailed back here, the Imperial soldiers arrested me and my son. They accused me of helping a Tazican spy escape with the tower key. I swear to God, if Mara has Can we it. fast forward, please? I had no choice. I told him everything to protect my son. The spy was caught in South Town and was... I'm so shamed. The key was never found. You should go ask yep, his yep, widow in South Town. Anyway. Tell her. I'm so sorry. Well, nice little character bit, but it's fucking hell we have to go talk to Mara anyway. Aaron says 24 is better. <laughs> 24. Okay. okay. 25. <laughs> and Zephy asked me, then why the hell am I playing this game if you think it's shit? Honestly, that your question is as good as mine. <laughs> I don't even know why I am playing this shitty game. I actually thought that this game was going to be good. I thought this game was going to be good, but instead I got... I got scammed. I, mean, I, think, I think it's good, it's just janky. <laughs> I like how I'm still dead. Okay, well, Jacob, we'll you scammed me. We'll go heal you in a moment. <laughs> you literally scammed me. Hello, you old bat. And we're talking to the freaking palm tree. My husband was about stealing a secret key on the go live. What did that fisherman tell you? Honestly, I really like Zeppi's There's nothing to be sorry about. Oh, man, birds, I should play yeah. engage but later there it is. on. I found the key hidden in my husband's things. I gladly exchanged it to have it back. Here, it's yours. I'll get my revenge. Be careful. Also, I can't hear this person. Really he sounds silent. Oh, really? Got gold yeah, power. he's really silent like Silent Hill. Sorry. Uh, it's fine. Anyway, we got the gold tower key. Yay! Are we going to Silent Hill land? We're going to Gold oh, Hill. Also, we have to go to a hotel, a decent hotel, Mario. Yeah, Hotel Mario. Do, 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 do. I can't now. Hopefully I can figure out how to get back to the golf place. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> That's the problem with the Mode 7 graphics, is you just end up running in circles all the time. Oh, there it is. Okay. There we we are literally running in circles. What the hell did you expect? I can now. Where's the freaking inn? It's over here. Um, I think I the inn was on the top. Yeah, a bit higher. Here we go. Yeah. At least this place is nice and fancy. The, and we oh, found yeah. the Arabian guy. 
So, uh, are we calling it here or? Um. Hmm. I mean, we could at least go check out the Golden Tower. Okay. Otherwise, otherwise, this is going to be a very short episode. <laughs> An hour or seventeen yeah, is not very, very short long. and boring episode. All right, I have to tag in again. There we go. Wow, yeah. this game is really slow. So slow. That's called lag. Hey, it's your best friends it's again. No, not these guys. Awesome. What are these things? Great fight. I want to pull out the cure water, Jose. <laughs> we should... Honestly, we should probably... Oh, no. I think we might I need to get... No. We should probably go upgrade our armor before we even consider turning <laughs> on the cure again. Yeah, we're gonna need to upgrade armor. Jose is also dead. Well, first, I got a better idea. Let's get some cups of wishes, because we spent a... We used a lot of those. <laughs> yeah. And then we'll spend the remaining money on uh, no. armor. If it is eight, it's one hit out, it's not probably a good time because we're probably just gonna go grind enemies and out for a while. Um. Yeah, well, fairy walnuts. Okay. Um. Yeah, I can't buy any of this shit. The only thing I can buy right. is a dragon helmet, or should I just save up for the duck helmet? You can buy the dragon helmet for yourself, but you can't wear the duck helmet. Oh, you're right. Good point. Hey, Jacob, I have a question. What? Would Zeppi be the type of person to play this game, Secret of Mana? Hmm. Good question, I don't know. Wow, <laughs> that's, a good, that's a good increase. Yeah, that bug plays around just in our kicked in. And we just Honestly, need to get you a better awesome helmet. Jacob? <laughs> you should probably ask him if he would ever play this game. Yeah, Zebby, would you play Secret of Mana? Why would I play this game? <laughs> Good reason, reasonable answer. Uh, Retro. <laughs> you literally... You Retro. are literally no different. Retro Arc really does not like this area. No, you I think even, I think that's um I think it's not retro art. Game. I think it's just an, I think it's just the game itself. I'm just talking about how it uh, lags a lot in this area in particular. No, that's in I'm pretty that's in game lag. It's not the emulator. You know, okay, I am already laughing at this point, at this answer. Uh, yeah, we should probably just head off to the mountain and cry profile to afford the armor. You want to grind the rest of this episode then? Uh, I feel like going and find the wolf. Slime. Ooh. Grab it so I can two shot. You're right. Alright, how about for the next like 10, 10 15 minutes we'll grind and then we'll call it a day. Make it five minutes. You can just head out, you know. Right, 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 right. Hmm. Your question is as good as mine. Why would... Why did I allow myself to torture myself over this dumb game? Oh, this is where you like to grind? Yeah. Okay. There's a lot of enemies around here. Yeah, I can see that. And they give decent money and experience at this point in the game. I'll take it. I'll just one shine that with magic so I can upgrade that. And since we got the uh, the shade recently, I didn't show that for him. Uh, dude, what are you doing? I was wondering why I couldn't use the magic. Well, for they? Yep, so, spoon grinding. Finny grinding. Or you're gonna do energy absorb and be rude. Rude. I'm almost done season one of Sailor Moon already. <laughs> I'm on like. That quickly? Yeah. Uh, 
it's it's awesome. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. I mean, you must really like you must really like magic, huh? Yeah, I, like I I mean I had a feeling I was gonna like Sailor Moon, but I didn't I didn't think I'd like it as much as I am. You know? That much? Yeah. <laughs> Honestly, this game is going to be canceled. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? You know what? That's a good suggestion. I wish this game was canceled. Well, people sure were canceling the remake when it came out. It was apparently <laughs> kind of mid. They probably see it as one of the worst remakes ever. The remake is well, just... I think it's not really so much that the remake's bad. It's just kind of an underwhelming remake from what people who grew up with this game said. You know, if you want a good remake, play Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. Like, if you compare if you compare the Secret of Mana remake to the Mario RPG remake, it's like pretty light, like night and day, which one had more care put into it. <laughs> Probably... Thousand Year Door. <laughs> yeah, granted, those were also like years apart. When did the Secret of Mana remake come out again? Yeah, uh, pretty sure it was back in like PS3 era or so. Yes, yeah, like, three. No okay, way. If you have a phone, you know, we could probably look that up right now. I'll look it up. Secret of Mana remake was 2018. Well, oh. okay then. Uh, so so PS4 era, just like PS4, but it's five years apart from the Mario RPG remake. Hey, Jacob. What? Zeppi told you to stop talking about TTYD. Look, I'll talk about what I want to talk about, man. <laughs> I wasn't even talking about it. I was talking about Sailor Moon, bro. <laughs> yeah, you did. You were talking about Thousand Year Door. No, I was talking about Mario RPG. No, you were definitely talking about Thousand Year Door. <laughs> so, Jacob, I have a question. What? Do you believe that there was some... Thought and care into the Thousand Year Door remake. Absolutely. Well, I mean, I haven't played it yet, but I'm gonna be playing it in like a day or two. Well, Jacob, I would. For my definitive answer, I would say either yes and no. I mean, the only thing I could. I, the only thing I'm just kind of bummed out about is the censorship in the 30 FPS. What censorship? Yeah, and probably they, they were the they were they removed um the Goombas hitting on Goombella. And probably the translation uh hey. changes. You wanna heal up or what? Yeah, I'm good. I mean I'm out of magic right now, but I can still attack stuff. Okay. I mean I've only been, I've been I've been just attacking them anyway. Honestly the only thing I've been doing about the translation for the remake is that that's about video under it. That's that's mostly all people are talking about. That's kind of just a boring topic of discussion, though. Mostly just a bunch of really bad people complaining about it, but they're lame. Yep. All right. Let, now we could go back and heal. It's a remake. They've been making thought and of character and built in them. Yes. Whatever that means. I read that kind of quickly. <laughs> yeah, we got a one thousand right now. Not they got a while to go. They got a while to go, though, because those dudes cost 30,000. 30,000 each. <laughs> and we found the Arabian guy. Well, Gnarly already has one, so we just need two sets. So we need 60,000. And I guess this could be a good excuse to level up our magic, too. Yeah. Well, your magic, because I don't have any. <laughs> and that's real here, Jose's probably not gonna do it. Jose's probably not gonna do much, but that's well, okay. Yeah, I probably won't do anything because Yeah, yeah. I still don't know how this game works. You're here to you're here to talk about F E and games. Which I you know what? That adds something to the conversation, so I'll take it. Thousand Year Door remake is Well obviously it's not even well it's not even a new game, it's mostly the same. I don't know though. The funny thing is that the ga the only games I've really been interested in the past like two or three years have been remakes. So that just goes to show you how like how shit games have become. That we're more excited about remakes than actually new games. Or your face. <laughs> your face. Face. Jacob, look. 
games have been literally declining since like 2000. 17. I mean, like, I mean, like, I won't say every new game is bad because I played, um, I played. Tell I, me I, they brought in your horizons. Oh god, there's a death trap in there. Jacob, I played Persona 5, and that shit was good. Okay, I guess, like, I'm trying to think of what's the most recent game I've played that's, like, like not a real game. Jose M4. Uh, well, uh, guess, we're wasting, guess we're wasting a couple wishes because this game is very fun. There I right. played Xenoblade 3, which also, is really also good. I just re also, I just realized we need to buy more chocolate. Yeah, honestly, we could probably could have just had access to those. I mean, Jacob, one of the recent games that I we'll played that after. was... Yeah. I mean, last year, it was Xenoblade again. Chronicles 3, and that was really good. Oh, are, you no, well, okay. are you fucking kidding me? Okay, can you hear me, please? Okay. I'm at literally one hand. Even though I was recommended. Alright, okay. please. But if it wasn't for Xenoblade 3, I would I wouldn't be talking about Mio that much. Level 34. Jose, can you heal him? No. Dude, I'm literally at one health. <laughs> Why? No. Not at all. This is a handy sword. I swear I'm not doing any damage to these guys. We need a Fire Emblem remake? I think, I think I'll be good on remakes after the TQID remake, to be honest. Well, I say that, I'm probably gonna also play Luigi's Mansion 2, but that's because I've never played that game before. I I don't want to play it on 3DS. I'm glad you played Dark Moon. No, it looks it suck on 3DS. <laughs> you told me you hate Dark Moon. When did I say that? Since years ago. I did not say that, bro. Yeah, you did. <laughs> what about well, what you, what about the 3DS re-release? <laughs> Send proof, or I don't believe it. <laughs> Sixteen thousand. Ooh, that's pretty good. Jacob, have you even played the 3DS remake? Uh, of the first game of Luigi's Mansion One. Now that that's an actually bad remake. <laughs> oh yeah, why? The game suffers from a heavy amount of slowdown, especially in multiplayer. They had a multiplayer to it? Yeah, that's where Gooigi comes from. How yeah. bad was the 3DS that's, remake? That's the only thing I know about that version, just that it adds Gooigi. Yeah, but if you play with Gooigi, the game it runs at like 20 FPS. It's fucking terrible. <laughs> Do not play that game in multiplayer well, without Jacob, patches. Doesn't most 3DS games play play at 20 FPS? Most of them play at 30, and some even run at 60. But that's a, because it's the 3DS, and I don't really expect the 3DS to run a lot of games like that well. If it runs consistently. What about Smash Bros. for the 3DS? I'm sure it can run at 60 frames. Yeah, Smash runs at 60. Superstar Saga Remake runs at 60. Those are the only two games that come to mind. I don't even know if Mario Kart 7 runs at 6, dude. Even Zeppi is complaining about you saying that the 3DS is very slow in frames. Tomodachi Life's 30. Well, it's because it's Tomodachi Life. Nothing... Nothing crazy happens in Tomodachi Life. It's supposed to be a wholesome game. <laughs> a wholesome game where I make me my me say shit like... Uh, bitch, and like, what the fuck, and stuff like that when they're mad. <laughs> if you're playing with the 3DS, then it's not like that. But you've had fun with the, the theater mode. I had fun with what? The theater. The theater? The musical bit. Oh, you saw that? <laughs> uh, no, not really. I just know that that's a thing in that game. Yeah, I, I did. I was having problems with that because. For some reason, I try to make my me sing shit, and then the game will just break and say like, "This me, the, the character doesn't know how to sing this," and I'm like, "What the fuck do you mean?" And I just, I just chalk it up to the game's like AI voices like being kind of dog shit. <laughs> I'm saying there's so much more just the game saying you shouldn't put that there. No, that's not even that's not even my point. My point, like sometimes I'll make them say a word, like a sentence, and then the sentence they just won't say it for some reason. Oh, for the love of you know, I think we should just not open chests what? here anymore. 
I can have to strap kill me. Uh, let's not waste that. That's that's money. That's a good idea. Um, let, let's ever let's open more treasure chests. I'll tell you. I'll tell you how to save money. Just don't open those chests anymore. <laughs> So the, the cup of wishes are like 500 pops, oh, so that's like pretty to try not to waste them. Nah, the cup of wishes are only like 300. Well, I mean, oh. it's only it's only All because... Right. You're thinking the of the fairy wall why nice. Zeppi thinks Tomodachi Life is mid is because he was included in Tomodachi Life. <laughs> hey man, what can I say? I like being inclusive. You like being cruel? Why do you make me want a honey cooler? God damn it. Well, Jacob... As someone, as someone told me, is to hate your enemy and see only evil in them. It's <laughs> mm. I lost track of what we were talking about. <laughs> That's not the reason, no. apparently. <laughs> wow, six forty-nine damage. Would that be. <laughs> 2004. No, it was definitely most likely that you were included in Tomodachi Life. I'm, I'm sure that's the reason why. Yeah, I guess we can heal up. Do you want to stop here or? Um, let's get let's get one set of armor, or like let's get one let's get armor for you or me. I don't really care who. Okay, so just six thousand gold more. <laughs> yep. <laughs> <laughs> so it's like one more round should do that. Yeah, it should be good. And then we'll be Okay, you know what? The Secret of Mana stream is getting more interesting. <laughs> Honestly, Especially... these, these, these these conversations is what's carrying it right now. Exactly. They just make it funny and more interesting. And I'm not going to become clunge today. <laughs> Oh yeah, the completionist did a new video on his top 10 PSP games. And you want to guess what the number one game was? You'll never guess. Why? Fantasy okay. 4. Fucking Crisis Core. <laughs> oh. Crisis Core. Okay, that's. Isn't that kind of? Isn't that kind of too obvious though? It was obvious. I saw it coming from a mile away. He did also Jacob put heal. He did also put Peace Walker on there. Oh, yeah, the one with Monster Honestly, Jacob, I really don't like Peace yeah. Walker that much. I don't think there was a Monster Hunter game on there. All I'm yeah, saying is that there was a lot of them. All I'm saying is oh, that Peace surprising. Walker, Peace Walker was an okay Metal Gear game. I just brought up Monster Hunter it's, because uh, Peace it's Walker had a special. crossover I with say, it. I would oh, honestly cool. say Portable Ops is better than Peace Walker. Now that's a that's probably the hottest take I've heard all day. Oh yeah, and why is that? I don't think I've ever heard somebody say Peace Walker is worse than Portal Walk. Come on, that's that's just how I feel. I I just prefer Portable Ops over Peace Walker. I'm not, I'm, not, I'm not saying that's a bad take though. I mean, to me, to me, Portable. I mean, I mean, to me, Peace Walker just felt so forgettable. Oh, so memorable about Portable Ops. <laughs> Portable Ops, I could at least remember a thing or two about it. Well, then what do you remember about it? Mostly... Mostly Gene, the, the main antagonist of... of Portable Ops. Then, what I can remember from the beginning is that... That Snake was taken hostage from the beginning of the game. Oh, so close to 666 damage. And then, for the first time, he, uh, Snake saw Roy Campbell for the first time since he was in prison. That's as pretty well cool, as at least. Snake. Hey, isn't, Honestly, isn't, poor, isn't Peace Walker the game that has the fucking guy called Hot Holdman? I... I don't know. That's a real fucking Metal Gear character. Oh, we got it now? Yeah, we got it. Fucking Hot Coldman. That has to be, like, the stupidest antagonist name of all time. Oh, yeah, and I also realized that 
one of the characters from MGS3 was still alive after the events of MGS3. Uh, who? Even oh, though he right. was supposed to be dead. Besides um, Eva. <laughs> yep. Even though he was supposed to be dead by... Oh, are you talking about, um... What's his name? Well, this is not where we're supposed to be, are we? Yeah, this is a different What were you about to say, Jacob? There's, um... What's his name? Uh, oh yeah, the Dark Sea Seahair's now. Uh, yeah, remember the desert place? Yeah, you know, we're talking about that now. Jacob, doing the DARPA that. Chief, Jacob, the DARPA chief died in M in MGS one. Yeah, and he was in MGS three. That was technically his first chronological appearance. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then he died in MGS one. Yeah, he was. Yeah, he was tortured by Ocelot. And Dang. I'm curious Liquid. what I'm curious what this hair does. Uh, this is what this guy was asking about. I you know what, forgot Jacob? about that. You know what, Jacob? I blame Liquid for turning Ocelot black. <laughs> oh my god, we returned water! Hooray, we returned the holy water! Got Moogle Belt? What is that? I have uh, no idea. You can use it to cure moogling or make some. It's in. It's functions as both an item if they respawn appropriately. Oh. You can use it to prevent moogling, okay? Yeah. I'm just fumbling over my words there. So, so let's if, just you, go. if you get moogled, you can just say, nah, fuck that, and just use that item and you don't be moogled anymore? Or maybe it's an equipable that prevents it, I don't remember. Exactly. You know, this game. Game. I'll have a look at it when we get into the gold town again. You know, it. this game should be in the same universe as Final Fantasy. I mean... This game and Final Fantasy have a little bit more in common than you think. And why is that? Considering the, uh, the first Mon- the first, uh, Mana game... ...was actually called, like, Final Fantasy Adventure in the West. I'm pretty sure. Final Fantasy Adventure? Mm-hmm, for the Game Boy. This that's technically the it's technically the prequel to Secret of Mana. Well guess what? So is Vagrant Story. It is also part of Final Fantasy. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. Them. Old Town, where are you? Okay, here we go. Yeah, good to see that this the game's mode seven airship exploration is just as confusing as FF6. Which did FF6 have a map though? Oh yeah, you're right. It did you know? I just you know, there's something. I'm it was still confusing though, because it was really fucking big. Were Moogles even were even included in Final Fantasy VII? Um. Uh, well, K H E he's he's uh is this one, but it's robot, but still. All right, we got the battle suit. Oh yeah, we should buy chocolates too. Hey, that's, can we hear a 400-year-old right now? We can afford chocolates. If there's one thing that Mooney can't buy, it cannot buy a Mooney. Wow, look at that. Wait, wait, you can't equip Holy it? Holy crap! Why so oh, much? So much defense. Because I skipped an upgrade that we gave to you. <laughs> yeah. Sound, you know, that sounds kind of boring when you say it like that. That's right. how it is. You have the next upgrade that came after what we're currently doing, right? That's okay, a lot well, of money. Sell the, sell the tiger suit, I guess. And maybe I can afford uh, something for myself. Am I wearing Am I wearing that, that bracelet already? Oh, the... No. The ring? Oh, we can't afford that. Never mind. I think I think I'm wearing that. <laughs> You're wearing um, the... I'm, wear, I'm wearing the other bracelet. Oh, let's get some chocolates and get some... Uh, some cups of wishes. Yeah, yeah get that... more of Willy Wonka's chocolate. <laughs> and then we'll head... eggs. Yes. Then, then we'll head to the end. Yeah. Fucking Wonka's right. golden eggs. <laughs> sell some you know, stuff. Jacob, I cannot overlook the fact. Actually, actually, we're, we're uh, quick. Wait, 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 wait. Quick question. I want to see something. Yeah. I want to see if um, I want to see how much I would get if I sold my current bracelet. You know, Jacob, I cannot overlook the fact that Wonka in 
the golden eggs video is walking. Um, yeah, I, I have a gold brick. I don't think I would have enough. It costs seven. Wait, I can sell this old one. Oh yeah, Jacob. Uh, Zephy is telling you to look at the DM. Okay. I'm very close to being able to afford that bracelet, though. Um, I, guess can, I guess we can have some off-screen fun with that. Hmm. <laughs> the end. He's a picture of Gus Frang with a Ron Fumo. <laughs> oh, I think That's I... That's pretty good. Isn't that kind of similar to the image that you sent me? Yeah, the one of Gus Frang holding Except... the big Romilia Fumo. Yes, that. I love that image. It's great. It's wholesome. You had too much... You played Jacob, why do you even like Romilia? I don't know. We're done. Alright, I think that's a good enough place to end. Anyways, the reason I like Romilia is because she's a, she's a small vampire. You know who else is a... You know who else is a vampire? Who? Alucard. True, except he's hot. So... He is hot. That's a different Any thoughts kid, Dracula? No. Not that one. <laughs> that's mini Alucard. That one, uh, that one I could go without, honestly. <laughs> although I heard the game, I, I heard the game is okay. What game are you talking about? That Kid Dracula Japanese exclusive. Oh, oh you mean that? You mean that obscure Game Boy game that wasn't even released on the West? Okay, but it was an NES, a Famicom version that wasn't released in the West. The Game Boy version was. Well, that's weird. <laughs> Why the fuck? Okay. Why well, call us weird? <laughs> You're so <Okay>. weird. <laughs> You're so weird. Alright, well that was uh, Secret of Mana, guys. We'll be back uh, next week again, where I guess we're gonna go to the Gold Tower for real this time. And maybe I'll grind a little bit of money off screen if I'm that bored and want my bracelet. But yeah. Jacob, uh, if you're so bored, then don't tell well, us. Well, see you guys then. Yeah.